Do charities spend too much on fundraising and administration? Now there's the elephant in the room. So let's unpack it a bit. First of all, some charities definitely do. Other charities don't. It's really about what you think is too much money to be spent on that. And the nice thing is, is you can actually find out how much charities spend on fundraising, management and administration because all registered charities in Canada are required to share that information publicly in annual filings. In fact, at Charitable Impact, you can go to a charity profile page and see their, their numbers on these things. And I encourage you to do that. Let's ask the question, what might be too much? And how do you get to those numbers? Some charities that are new will need to share and spend more on brand awareness, right? Other charities that have a dedicated donor base that participates in them as a charity won't have to do that as much. Contrast a brand new charity that's, you know, for maybe a health concern as opposed to a church or a mosque or a temple that has a regular constituent donor base that attends it every week. The church mosque scenario is going to have a very low percentage of fundraising because they don't need to build a brand profile or spend money uh, convincing people to donate as compared to other types of charities. So do think about that. The other thing to think about is where the cost of fundraising comes from. So if I have to ask you to give money, it's gonna cost me money to do that. If I don't have to ask you to donate, that cost starts to shrink or dissipate towards zero. So if you're really opinionated about charities having too much fundraising expense, recognize the role that you play in that as a donor or as a non-donor in particular, because if you're not giving money voluntarily in a proactive way, charities who require money to maintain their operations are gonna to have to spend money finding you and asking you to give. So the best way to reduce fundraising costs for charities is to start becoming a proactive donor yourself and tell your friends to do the same.